right, let's talk about the epochs and how to use it to uh, run a gas. This is the epoch machine itself. All you have to do is flip it open. The monitor come off the base. There's a red on button. The base have a on button. So in order to log in, you have to scan your badge. You can either press this yellow button right here or on the side. There's another yellow button on the side right here. At this point, if it's not connected, double click on this icon and it will connect the base to the monitor. Once you see the screen, you know it's connected. All right, for the patient ID, put the patient MRN number. And then you see right here, it says insert card to begin testing. You gotta get a card out. This is a card, the EPOP card. So get one out. You want to turn it around this is where you're gonna put the sample okay so first thing you want to insert the card into the base like so so it can calibrate the card can inject your sample one of the ways. You can use a blood gas syringe or you can use a cap tube. You need to get a capillary gas. Um, there is a cover that goes on top which can fit onto the card itself. You should have enough sample to go all the way to the white line. Now I'm gonna um, put some sample in so you can see. Okay. The cap on top, okay, and this act like the tip of the syringe. All right, now it's time to inject the sample. I'm going to use the cap stick, okay. So, this is how you want to do. This is a plunger, so you put it straight in and you press on the top until you hear a beep. So that's your result. So now you can also print this result out. You can turn it on. And on the machine, on the monitor. There's a printer icon. Press that printer icon. Yes. That's your result. Now we we can exit it out. We can turn it off. Pull your sample out, throw it away.